In this video, we provide the solution to question number four for practice exam number one for Math 1030, in which case we're given here a weighted complete graph, and we're asked to solve the traveling salesman problem on this graph using the nearest neighbor algorithm starting at B. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start at B. We're gonna look at the, who's the nearest neighbor to B. So going to C would be 3.3, going to D would be 5.9, going to E would be 6.8, and going to A is 3.6. Um, C is the short is the nearest neighbor right there, so we're gonna go to C next. Okay. Then we're at C. We could go to A for 1.1, we could go to E for 3.5, or we could go to D for 5.3. 1.1 is the nearest neighbor to C. So we're going to go there. Now be aware that we can't go back to B yet because that would make a premature circuit. So we're just going to remove that number from consideration so we don't accidentally be tempted by it. Because honestly, 3.6 is the next cheapest one for A here. So, But we can't go back there. Can't go back to C. So for A, we have to either go to D for 5.6 or we go to E for 4.5. 4.5 would then be the cheapest one there. So we're going to go to E. Now that we're at E, we can't go to B. We can't go back there until the very, very end. Uh, we can't go back to C yet either. So we actually are forced to go to D at that moment. Uh, D is going to cost five. Now that's the last vertex. We got to go back home. So then we're going to connect the dots here. And that's our circuit. Um, so let's add these things together. We have a 3.3 plus 1.1 plus 4.5 plus 5.0 plus 5.9, adding those together, you end up with 19.8. And so we see that the correct answer is choice B.